Well, they were actually back, so I'm actually laughing. Oh, I can't see. Alright, we're good. Um, so, I just got done cooking some pancakes, protein pancakes. Um, I'm gonna go over the ingredients right quick for you guys. Because I haven't been able to perfect the protein pancakes yet, but I just made some really good ones, so. I'll go over the ingredients with you guys and I'll show you my pancakes because they turned out pretty good. So, what I used for this was one cup of flour, or one cup of oat flour. It took me like five minutes to grind up some damn oats. So, a cup. Um, yeah, if you're going to grind up oats, use like a small blender because the big ones, like I have a Hamilton Beach blender, which is like a one serving one, and then I have like an oyster one. The oyster one sucks at grinding stuff up. So, yeah. That's the... I use oats instead of, like, regular flour. Um, you can, you can... You don't have to exactly grind up oats. You can just go to, like, Big Lots or, like, the store and buy, like, the Red Baron um, oat flour. They, they have a lot of, like, a lot of different products. Um, they have rice. They have... Um, I think they have grits, they have, um, I think wheat germ, I don't know, a couple of different healthy things you can eat, um, hello, okay, come on, come on, say up, my babies, alright, so, there's oat flour, and, um, while I'm doing this video, I'm gonna do a review for the Twin Labs, um, I think it's 100, um, cookies and cream protein powder? Or twin fuel protein powder. Go get you some because this is good. I went to Rite Aid yesterday, and while I was buying a bunch of um, bags of hot Cheetos, I did a video yesterday on three three types of hot Cheetos. I did the um, I'll get back to the ingredients right quick, but I did regular hot fries, the flaming hot extra or double X extra hot. Cheetos, and then I did Flame Hot Munchies. To be honest, like um, like an hour after I did that video, because I couldn't talk while I was doing the video, like half an hour or an hour after I did that video, I passed out from just the, I felt like shit after doing that. So, and I ate all three, ba I, like I ate two bags, the Flame and Hot, um, I ate the Frito, the fries, and then I had like two thirds of the bag of Flame and Hot, the extra hot ones. And I, I couldn't eat the rest of them because they were too hot. I had like a giant lemon taste in my mouth or lime, whatever they used. But it was just like lemony. So I was like, okay, I can't do this no more. I had trouble talking. I couldn't, like my my vocabulary was slurred. So it sucked. But yeah, I bought me some Twin Lab protein powder. It was the bomb. Like right I had it for like $14. And usually like the little bags cost like $20, $21. So I'm like, I'm not about to buy that shit. But... Also, like, one thing about Rite Aid is, like, if you have a card, it kind of helps a little bit, but if you don't, the prices are fucking high. And that, like, on the last day of school, I had to take a test, and I didn't have no pencils or paper with me, so I went to Rite Aid and bought them, and their paper was, like, 4 or $5, dollars i am like, what the fuck? Their pencils were, like, $3. Like, for one single pencil, one single pen, it was, like, fucking $3. So, that threw me off. But anyways, so we get back to the ingredients. So, here's one cup. One full cup of oat flour. So I grinded the oats up. It took me like five and a half minutes just to grind them up. And it was bad. But I grinded them up. I probably didn't get all of them, but it's alright. I did most of them. Alright. I didn't add the sugar until like after. But it calls for sugar. So. And it gave it some flavor. Like with sugar. Sugar. If you don't use sugar. Like I know people think that all of the, the zero calorie sugars or sweetener are healthy, but if you think about all the healthy shit that we actually look at, nine times out of ten, they have more shit in them than they really say they do, so, I did use two tablespoons, or, no, two teaspoons of baking powder, and the baking powder, what it does, like, if you've had protein, uh, protein pancakes before, protein pancakes, they're, like, really thin, so, it, the baking powder actually helps it out. Um, so, it made them rise a lot. Um, I used one tape, one teaspoon of salt, one egg, and a cup 
of milk and two tablespoons of vegetable oil. Um, what I did for sweetness was I added the protein powder in, and like I stirred it all up, and and at first when I tasted it, it didn't taste like protein powder, or it didn't taste like um, pancake mix, but all the ingredients I added into it were, they were refined for the protein pancakes, so it wasn't too bad. Um, like after I made the first two pancakes, because there's four right here, I actually ate part of one, but you can see there's four right there. And they turned out pretty, like, a decent color, but at one point, like, some of them, like, you can see right here, so one of them burned. And I didn't know if they cooked, so they still cooked fast, even after you put, like, baking powder and vegetable oil in them. Um, I didn't know all that, so hold up, turn this down a little bit. Um, I'm actually about to start playing Call of Duty, because that's, like, my favorite game to play on PS4, like, the only game I like playing besides, like, um... Well, I played, I have both Call of Duty Ghosts and Call of Duty War, or Advanced Warfare. Um, but yeah. So, I'm gonna, what I did, uh, the, the Twin pro, twin Man Protein Powder. It is, actually I made me a protein shake, and the, from my last protein review video, um, the mixability for it is really good. Like, I didn't expect it to be, like, all that great. Oh, no, it's not open. Never mind. I thought it was open, but um, I mixed it up, and I don't know if you can see it, but there's no clumps at the bottom of it. So that was a plus on my side. Um, taste wise, it tastes okay. It tastes like cookies and cream. Um, since I added it into my um, my Arnold Way protein container, I actually didn't finish the Arnold Way one. Like I had probably this much left in it, and to be honest, I got tired of it because it was too thick. So, I didn't finish that one, I ended up throwing it away. Um, and, I don't know, like in the last three years, I probably bought like nine different protein powders. Um, and I'm not gonna lie, like it's hard to, if you got like a protein powder that you don't like, I know some people won't finish them, and I don't know, it's just preference, I guess. But, the protein shake though, like it, it calls for... I think six ounces, six to eight ounces of water or cold water. I put milk because I'm a milk dude. I don't like protein powder or just water. It tastes awkward. And yeah. So on to these pancakes. If you make these, like use protein powder on them. Like regular pancakes, because I had to Google how to make like just pancakes from scratch. Because all I do for my pancakes, if I make pancakes, I just use water and regular pancake mix or Bisquick mix, um, or even the um, what is it? Some store brand, can't remember what it is, but I think it's like Pantry or something like that. But yeah, like if you want just like regular pancakes, like regular breaded pan or bread pancakes. Pancake mix, water, and maybe some cinnamon or some peanut butter. Um, maybe some a banana. Um, chocolate or chocolate chips, whatever, whatever your preference pre preference is. But yeah, that's my review. Um, my review. If I had to give it like a taste, what guys? Pretty decent. Out of ten stars, I'd probably give it like a eight, because it it tastes just it tastes good, like cookies and cream. Um, oh my god, I thought I don't do that. Shit, go back. God damn it. Um, sorry guys, I'm like trying to fix my Call of Duty screen. Shit isn't going. Go like super visible. All the visibles have to be the same, I guess. I'm almost up. In about two hours, I have to leave for work, so. Alright, so I'm going to the multiplayer. Um, but, anyways, guys, so yeah, that's my review and my recipe for how to make protein pancakes. Um, 
I'll put a, not really a link in the description because I don't know where I got this from. But if you Google how to make pancakes from scratch, it will show you. Um, yeah. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I think I can show you guys. Hold up. Let's see. Go back. Back. I want to just go through history. I'll show you guys while I'm on this video. Or while I'm making this video. Um. Give me a minute, guys. Hold on. Oh, it doesn't show. Wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. Go. Yeah, it doesn't really show, so. I'm on my tablet, if you don't know. It's a Samsung Galaxy Tab 4. Um, I don't know. Something about this tablet. Like, at first, I thought it was the greatest thing ever until the screen started freezing, so. You know, I might just go get another one. Actually, I won't get another one, but I'll try to keep this one since I kept my other one. You know, the other one was a little smaller, but it's whatever. Anyways, that's it, guys. I'll see you guys later. I went to the gym earlier. You know what's stupid, though? Because I didn't know the gym I would just start going to. I didn't know it was closed on Sundays. But that's how my morning started, guys. I went to the closed gym. <laughs> I'll see you guys later. I wanted to add music in here, but it's whatever.